<laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to Do On The Couch. And if you're new to my channel, a very warm welcome to yourselves. I hope that you had a happy Easter weekend, whatever you did. I spent mine in London with my daughters, my sister, my brothers, my niece, my uncle, auntie and cousins. You can tell that I was excited. <laughs> It was really fantastic to see everyone after several months of not being able to do so. Anyway, back to today. In my last video, um, I think about a week ago, I spoke about the relationship expert and a love cheat, Derek Jackson and his wife, Danae Jackson. And the fact that um, Derek Jackson garnered thousands and thousands of new followers after his um, confession video and yet his wife was being ridiculed on social media for standing by her cheating husband. I would like to follow that video with a video on self-worth and strength. I believe that these are lessons that every young girl, every young woman should grow up with. Um, we need to affirm our daughters all our daughters, but especially those with absent fathers, so that they won't ever feel the need to fill up that void with um, another man. And I'm not saying that they will all do that, but a good percentage will unfortunately um, do so. We need to tell our daughters that they're loved, that they are smart, they're beautiful, they are worthy of taking up space in this world. They are worthy of being seen, of being heard, of being treated with respect. Um, unfortunately for me, and I'm sure many other women, I learned these lessons late in life and I learned them the hard way. Um, and I'm hoping that I have um, effectively taught this well to my um, own daughters. Many of us at one point um, in our lives, we struggle with feelings of um, low self-worth, of emptiness, um, hopelessness, and these affect um, the choices that we make, the decisions that we make, especially in relationship, in relation to um, romantic relationships, romantic partners. Um, we accept being treated less than, we accept being spoken down to, we accept being cheated on, um, we accept our partners being complacent with our hearts and taking us for granted. And this is because we believe that is what we deserve or we have been told um, and conditioned to believe that that's what we deserve. And some partners will go as far as telling you that nobody else is going to want you. And um, because you don't want to be alone, you don't want to be lonely, you stay and endure. We seek external validation in whatever way that we can, just, just to try and um, fill up that void, you know, that emptiness, that hopelessness. Um, unfortunately, these negative feelings then lead to poor mental health that in turn affect our physical health and other aspects um, of our lives. The only person who can fill a void in yourself is yourself you need to embrace yourself with all your imperfections you need to acknowledge your feelings um, you need to set boundaries set the tone of how um, somebody is going to treat you you're beautiful you're smart and you are worthy you need to believe it you need to believe in your magic and you need to seek strength to walk away from anything that demeans you, from anyone that demeans you. If these past couple of years have taught me anything at all, it is that life 
is indeed precious but also very short so don't waste it do not waste it believe in your magic and i will see you next time on the undercover